guys, it's me, Dilla, and today we are going to be doing some art. Here I have got a cute little bunny with its friend, a butterfly. And we've got some really nice colours here. Um, some water and a paper towel here. And some gloss. And today we're going to be painting this bunny and butterfly. So let's get started and opening it. Where's my scissors? Okay, here we go. This is a plaster bunny. Comes with everything. This is an apron. Let me see what this says. So these are the instructions, but I know the instructions. So basically, all this comes with is a paper plate to do it on, the the thing, and some paints and gloss here, and the butterfly and apron. I'm gonna put this apron on. And, uh, I'm just going to go ask my mum how to put this on. So I have now got my um, thing on. And let's get starting. So first it says, open the paint set caps carefully. Do not leave paint caps open as it will dry, up, dry out. So I'm going to put this um, on my plate. And then I'm going to show you each time I do one colour. I'm just going to take this colour first, which is going to be the colour of the bunny, which is this nice purple one. I'm going to unscrew it carefully. Where's that paintbrush? Get my paintbrush, dab in some water, and paint. So, yeah. Wow, that's pretty. I'm going to do the rest of this and then we'll move on to the next colour. So I have now just finished the um, paint of the body. Looks like this. I don't want to drop it. So the next colour I'm going to do is the ears. And the ears are going to be this one or this one. Which one? So this is the darker one, this is the lighter one. I'm going to test it. And the lighter one wins. So my um, paintbrush has just been um, sitting in the water for a few minutes. And I think it's ready. I'm going to dab it on my paper towel. Yeah, that's not done. I need some more time in the water. And guys, well that sits in the water. I'm just going to tell you that I have left the tail white. Because like rabbits have white tails, right? But they're not purple. So I'm just, I'm just leaving it white because it looks cute. Funny time. The bunny. Yep, that's good. So now we're moving on to this colour. This colour is actually my favourite colour. It's just like really nice. In, in, in. Um, I can actually tell you where I got this from. So... It's in Birkenhead Point in um you in Australia, and um it's only on the school holidays, so you can only go on the school holidays. And it's like you know when you're on your way to Coles, there's like a big setup there. And you can do it there. You can also take one home.
So I also painted her cheek. So that's really cool. Now I'm going to let this set again and move on to her eyes. Hmm, what color should we do her eyes? I think I'm going to do a, the blue. It's nice blue. I have not used these paints before. They're like really cool. My mum really likes my art. Okay. Testing. Testing is good. So now we're going to do her beautiful eyes. Oh, okay. okay. Now she's staring at me, which is a bit freaky. Okay. Well, at least her eyes are done. My bunny. Now we're going to do like this part. I think that calls for this one or this one. I'm just going to go ask my mum. So my mum said we should do this one because on the cheek it's that pink. And I wanted to change it up so I said she was right. I'm going to do this one. Come on. This takes a long time. Okay. It's done. Testing. Testing good. And we're going to do some like little, um, no, because we don't have that color, but whatever. Ew. Look at that. This yuck. Oh, that is so cute. <laughs> And mum, mm -hmm. what colour should we do like for the place where it goes down? Like that one. Oh, I would make that all the same colour. Oh. That's part of his nose skin. It's a boy, it's a girl, mum. Okay, that is beautiful, really nice, really beautiful. So I'm just going to let that dry and I'm going to go get something that you might like. So guys, I also did this one, a horse at the place. And, um, and Jenny, Jenny's mum, I had a play date with my friend Olive. And her mum was really nice and she bought me this one to do at the place. And this bunny one to do at home. So I'm going to be shouting out um, Olive and her mum in the next, in this video and the next two videos. So shout out to them. This is a beautiful horse I did. And now that is dry. That's my bunny. Then those just is really weird. Yay. So now I'm going to get a paper towel. Let it dry on the floor. So now we are moving on to this little butterfly. Putting it in the stick. Right in the middle. Let's see if this is... No, it still has pink on it. Testing. Yeah, let's test it. Good. What I think we need to do with it. This colour. This dark one. It's like a dark purple. Oh yeah, I've got pink on my hands. So I'm going to go in with the dark purple and just do that long line. See the long line in the middle? Mum, you can turn the kettle on. It's fine. 
Now I'm going to do um, some rinsing. This butterfly has to be colorful. Next, I want to do is the nice um, light blue. <laughs> that rhymes. So basically, it's good. Enough. It's good. I'm going to get the light blue. And do those little dots. Guys, you might have to turn the volume up on your um, thing, but it's fine. I'm just trying to like do every single dot. Okay. So that is the dots. I think it looks really pretty. So now I'm going to rinse. And I think I want to do some of this light purple, which I colored the bunnies body. This one. I think I'm going to do like the lines coming out. fat rush. I don't know why I just said that. So that is our butterfly so far. Now I'm going to add some like splodges. What color should I do the splodges? Maybe that um this pink. That would be nice. Testing, testing good. Ah, oh, no. It's not testing good. So, now I'm going to get this one. The paintbrush. And I'm just going to do some three dabs here. So I think our little butterfly is finished. That is so cute. I think this is the cutest little picture ever. So I'll show you the bunny one last time. It's a girl. It's cute. And then this is the little butterfly. That is all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button and notification bell so you don't miss another cool and creative video like this one. Bye guys!